Hello guys, welcome to my channel. So whenever you open Windows 10 settings and when you go to Windows update and when you check for update, over here you can see it tells you this PC can run Windows 11, but over here you don't see any option to click on install. So install button is missing. So if this is what is happening, then please follow the steps shown in this video. Actually, the reason is that Microsoft is rolling out updates, but it's a little bit slow. So for this, you can go ahead and install Windows 11 using Windows 11 installation assistant. So you can go ahead and copy this link. The link is provided in the video description. Open this link in a browser. Here you can see Windows 11 installation assistant. Click on download now. And then go ahead and run this exe file. Click on yes to allow. So you can go ahead and use Windows 11 installation assistant to update to Windows 11. Mine is already up to date, so I'm not running that. So you have to simply have to go ahead and run that. It will go ahead and check for update. You will see the install option update it, and you will not lose any data on the computer. The option to keep personal data and files are already checked by default. So you will not lose the, any data on the computer. Now, still you're facing the problem. In that case, you can use media creation tool. So you can go ahead and click on download now and then run this exe file then you will see the screen click on accept and by default windows 11 would be selected so click on next and then you have to go ahead and select iso file then click on next and then select the location where you want to save the file you can go ahead and select desktop and then click on save now once the download is complete you can go ahead and click on finish and after that you can go to desktop you have to go ahead and open this windows iso file so make a double click and then you have to go ahead and run this setup file. So make a double click on setup file. Click on yes to allow. And this will load Windows 11 on your computer. And click on install Windows 11. Click on next. And this will go ahead and check for update. And this process will take some time. But before the installation, you will see this screen which says ready to install. And by default, the option to keep personal files and app would be checked. Now, when this is checked, you will not lose any data on the computer. So you can go ahead and click on install. And that should go ahead and help you to install Windows 11 successfully without losing any data on the computer. So in both the cases, if you are using Windows 11 installation assistant or if you are using Windows media creation tool, in both the cases, you will not lose any data on the computer because you will have this option checked by default, which says keep personal files and app. So click on install and then you should be able to upgrade to Windows 11 without waiting. So that'll be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.